So one of the major motivating parts, parts of our particular stream um, is this idea of climate change. Uh, and so one of the major drivers of climate change is fossil fuels, where we take fuels out of the ground, burn them, and put that carbon into the atmosphere. Uh, in the biology of biofuel stream, we study a grass species, um, which is potentially going to be a major biofuel crop. The major difference here is the plant is taking carbon out of the atmosphere, we're harvesting it, burning it, putting it back in. So therefore, it's carbon neutral. Uh, that particular species is Panicum brigatum, or switchgrass. And my students, who you can maybe see in the background, um, are going to be focusing on cold tolerance. The idea here is you've got individuals collected from all over its range. We harvest leaves, we take them back to the lab, we measure how well they tolerate cold temperatures, uh, and that way we can see if there's variation across its geographic range in cold tolerance. What we're, whatever we're doing here, even though sometimes it's pretty tedious and overwhelming, it feels like you're doing something. We're not actually working on the architecture or the um, engineering of the crop, but we're just trying to understand this plant that nobody has actually studied. And I really like it because I'm getting like a hands-on experience of what, what they're doing. Um, I'm, I can talk with this really intelligent people with a lot of experience um, about what they're doing, what they found. It's been really helpful because I actually know what research is now. I actually know what is involved in doing research. Um, what you have to do to become a researcher, all the hard work it, you need to do, and the payoffs. We all get the same sun and the same sweat and the same work. And that's difficult to see, I think, in other areas because there's always like, oh, I'm in this position, so I, I'm not supposed to do what you're doing, and you're going to do the hard stuff, and I'm just going to do the intellectual stuff. But no, like, people here are not afraid of doing hard work and helping out because they're very passionate about what they're doing. And you can see that on, on their daily work and how much effort they put into it. <laughs> 